take a moment, say your goodbyes. Chris Harrison is saying goodbye to the Bachelor franchise after 19 years as host. ET has learned that negotiations over Chris's exit have been underway for a while, but concluded late Monday night. This is the final rose tonight. And a source tells ET that the longtime host will receive an eight figure payout as part of his exit agreement. In an Instagram post on Tuesday, Chris expressed gratitude following the major announcement, writing, I've had a truly incredible run as host of the Bachelor franchise, and now I'm excited to start a new chapter. I'm so grateful to Bachelor Nation for all of the memories we've made together. While my two decade journey is wrapping up, the friendships I've made will last a lifetime. We're a victim of our own success being around 15 years, but I get to know and love a lot of these people and they kind of become friends and family and, and now they're married and having babies and it's it's a beautiful thing. Of course, this all comes after he announced in February that he would be taking a step back from the franchise after his controversial comments during an interview with Rachel Lindsay, where he appeared to defend Bachelor contestant Rachel Kirkinell's past racist actions. The picture was from 2018 at an Old South antebellum party. So I think, you know, when you when you it's, it's when not, you hold that under the lens, look. it's not a good look. Well, it's not a good. Well, Rachel, is it a good look in 2018 or is it not a good look in 2021? It's because not there's a, a big good difference. look ever. After facing backlash for his controversial remarks, Chris issued an apology. And during a virtual appearance on Good Morning America in March, he admitted he, quote, made a mistake. I am an imperfect man. I made a mistake and I own that. I believe that mistake doesn't reflect who I am or what I stand for. I am committed to the progress, not just for myself, also for the franchise. The 49-year-old reality host also expressed his hope to someday return to the franchise. I plan to be back and I want to be back. This interview is not the finish line. There is much more work to be done and I am excited to be a part of that change. Chris started hosting the ABC series in 2002 and later went on to host its spin-offs like The Bachelorette, Bachelor in Paradise, and more. And I think for me as the host, producer, friend, psychologist that I am, it, it allowed me in deeper and allowed me to do my job better and be a better friend, be a better confidant. But Bachelor Nation hasn't seen the reality host do his job in a while now. In March, former NFL star Emmanuel Acho stepped in to host The Bachelors after the final row special for Matt James. It's time to look ahead to the future. Shortly after, ABC announced that former Bachelorettes Caitlin Bristow and Tasha Adams would co-host Katie Thurston's journey to find love. Let the journey begin. Bring on the mess! Do you think it was important for him to take some time away, step away, and like, you know, give it some room? Yeah, I mean, yeah. I echo everything that the alumni have come together to speak on Chris and you know, I think he's taken the time away, which is probably a good decision for him. Do you think he should come back at all? You know, I think whenever he feels like he's ready, then that's a decision that he has to make, mm -hmm. you know, with the, the franchise. As for Michelle Young's upcoming season of The Bachelorette, E.T. has learned that there are no decisions yet on who will host. I'm just excited. <laughs> I'm ready to get started. <laughs> yeah. But in the meantime, producers are focused on Bachelor in Paradise as it's set to begin filming in late June. E.T. has learned that there will be multiple celebrity guest hosts filling in during the upcoming season, David Spade being one of them. I am the ultimate. I mean, that's what I do. I help people find love. As for Bachelor Nation, a source tells E.T. that Chris's exit could be good and positive. Quote, they are excited about this new chapter for the show and are thinking of it as a new opportunity for more people to become fans and part of the Bachelor family. Former Bachelor Colton Underwood shared a heartfelt message to the longtime host on Instagram. So did former leads Jojo Fletcher, Ari Leyendijk Jr., and Sean Lowe, who expressed their love and well wishes.